Hey guys, welcome back. This is Diana from First Rain Furniture and today I'm excited to announce that we will be participating in the Unique Antique Challenge hosted by none other than Crystal from the Crafty Creech and Lavon from La Vintage Decor. For those of you new here, this is a furniture flipping challenge that has a unique twist. This time, the theme is vintage tattoos. Check out the playlist below to see what this fabulous furniture community has come up with. So if you're a fan of furniture flipping, vintage tattoos, or just want to see how I give some old furniture a new life, make sure to stick around for the entire video. I can't wait to get started and I know you're going to love the final result. Let's get to work. For this challenge, I'll be working on this pair of bar stools. These bar stools have seen better days, but with a little love and creativity, I know I can transform them into unique and beautiful pieces of furniture that truly reflect the vintage tattoo theme. I was inspired by this tattoo. The lotus is a gorgeous flower and it holds a special significance in many cultures and traditions around the world. In ancient Hindu and Buddhist traditions, the lotus flower symbolizes growth, new beginnings, and spiritual enlightenment. The lotus grows in muddy water and yet, despite its difficult growing conditions, it blooms into a clean, pure, and beautiful flower. This is seen as a metaphor for the human journey and the idea that no matter what challenges we face, we can overcome them and bloom into something beautiful and enlightened. I love using my Cricut to make stencils because I can personalize them exactly the size and shape that I need them. 
I usually don't apply any adhesive or tape to hold my stencils anymore, but you can definitely do so if you would like. Krylon Easy Tack has worked really well for us in the past. In addition to the lotus flower, I was also inspired by the Indian wedding tradition of Mendi, which is a type of henna tattoo. It is often applied to the hands and feet of the bride in beautiful designs. It's believed to bring good luck and blessings to the bride and is seen as a symbol of love and commitment between the bride and groom. Mendi is often decorated with those intricate designs and gold details, and I wanted to incorporate this element into my bar stools. I also have a personal connection to Mendi as well, as I traveled to Pakistan 14 years ago for a wedding and had a beautiful henna tattoo done on my hands in preparation to celebrate with the bride and groom. So in addition to the lotus tattoo stencils, I'll also be adding some beautiful gold details with this paint pen to really make these bar stools stand out. And that's a wrap. I hope you enjoyed following me on this exciting furniture flipping journey and learning about the symbolism of the lotus flower and the Indian wedding tradition of Mendi. I'm so proud of the final result and I can't wait to see what you think of these unique and beautiful bar stools. If you're inspired to try your hand at furniture flipping or have any questions about the process, make sure to leave a comment below. I would love to hear from you and see what you're working on. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and stay up to date on all of our latest projects. Thank you so much for watching and as always, stay blessed.